Looking ahead now, one of the two young men charged with killing Hope Mills teenager Danielle Locklear in 2014 will be sentenced today. Dominique Locke and Jamichael Malloy were arrested for the 2014 killing. CBS North Carolina's Justin Quisenberry is live here in the studio with more on this case. Justin. Locke pleaded guilty in July of last year to being an accessory after the fact to first degree murder and will be sentenced this morning in Cumberland County. He's accused of helping Jamichael Malloy, who pleaded guilty to second degree murder last month. Malloy, who was Daniel Locklear's ex-boyfriend, could spend up to 25 years in prison. Malloy confessed to choking Locklear during a fight. Investigators say Locke helped him tie cinder blocks to Locklear's body and threw her in the South River, where the 15-year-old's body was found the next month. All I can say is that this is a tragic event for the family of the victim, for the families of the suspects. Everybody involved is young. Everybody involved had their whole life ahead of them. Locklear's family has made a point of being at court appearances throughout this two-year-long process. We will be in the courtroom today and we'll let you know of what the developments are. Uh, ahead in our half hour, just ahead, we'll let you know what Locklear's mother said about Malloy's pleading guilty last month.